Hello viewers, this is Alma the Stars. Welcome to another Let's Play I'll be doing, Pan Paro, Pan Hams Unite. Now this may seem like a quizzical choice to be performing, but there is a good reason behind this. Mainly, um, this is actually what I consider an ideal adventure game. Now that may, be that may blow some of your minds there, but that's the way I see it. I will go into further detail on that later, so for now, let's start a new game. Uh, let's go to the clubhouse, I guess, since we can't go anywhere else, and, uh, oh, I wonder who this is. Uh, apparently he's busy. Hello, Mr. So Busy. No, nah, no, that's not his real name, but, uh, who is he, anyway? Um, alright, I guess we could do you a favor, and let's just go with the default name, Hamtaro. I mean, we're only the main character. Uh, yes. Oh, of course. Of course it's us. I mean, we were only with you through the anime, and... Well, we are the main character, too, and... Oh, you want us to bring them here? Um, well... Alright, I guess we gotta gather the ham hams together. I mean, that does kind of fit the title anyway, and, uh... Oh, ham chat. Um... Yeah, what is that? Uh... Apparently, it's a very big shock. No. It's, uh... What it is, it's pretty much the, uh... It's the speech, speech system of the game, in a sense. Um, basically, you use it to interact with hamsters, do stuff, and etc., etc. And, uh, he's gonna teach us some, apparently. So, let's, uh, follow him into the next room, involuntarily. Travel scene, and we're in a sort of dance studio, I guess. Alright, more room here. And, uh, dug something up, eh? Um, a book. Huh. Alright, well, how's this book gonna help us? Um, it's a notebook. Yeah. Brand new. I thought it was dug up. Oh, well. Oh, well, this is gonna be our ham chat dictionary, apparently. So, uh, okay. He just taught us our first word. Let's use it. We learned it. And in the book it goes. Ooh. That was a bit loud. Well, uh, no matter. So yeah, that's how you say hello in the game. When you want to talk about the hamster, just use that word. Like I'm going to be using oh so many times throughout this game. And... Huh, I guess you can tackle stuff here. Tack you. Kind of tacky. Heh <laughs> Ah. Uh. Okay. Right. And, you know what? Sort. I want to sort them by alphabetical. I don't know. That's just the way I like it. You may want to do it in the order received, but I prefer alphabetical in this, these games. So, yeah, that's how you just roll into stuff. It's kind of fun at times, and helps you find hidden items in other places. And now he's teaching us Hip Hip, which allows us to pick up stuff. It's honestly a very prolonged animation, which kind of sucks in a sense. Uh, it's kind of nice though, they have this little sub-menu there, as you saw just there, which allows you to see how many ham words you seen how many ha ham hams you found, uh, how many seeds you have, etc, etc. It's kind of, a uh, neat, but, uh, I don't know, it, it's an old game, so, it's kind of, or, I wouldn't say original, but substandard anyway, I don't know. Anyway, next term, uh, Dig Dig. Basically, you see, uh, dirt like this, or you may not, and you will find stuff. But, well, we didn't find anything this time, but, oh well, we learned Dig Dig. Which allows us to dig, apparently, obviously. Well, yeah, as he's saying, there's gonna be times where you won't find anything, and then again, there may be times where you won't see a patch like this, and yet you can still use Dig Dig. Um, and, yeah, right now, he's just going to give us some extra words to, uh, have, because obviously he's not going to show us every word, I mean, he apparently only gave us the basics anyway, so yeah, let's uh, 
head on back into this room. And, uh, oh yeah, that was the dance room. I, I probably spoiled that ten, uh, three minutes early. So yeah, he, yeah, he's not gonna give us a full tour, or, or I guess he is. Alright, so this is where the ham ham rooms are located. Once you rescue, once you, uh, bring back a ham ham, you can go in there and, uh, you can talk to the ham hams you've recovered. Uh, that's not a seating chart, it's a, uh, it's sort of a map. It'll let you know whose room is where once you've, uh, recovered them. And you can use that door to leave the, uh, clubhouse. So, yeah, we're gonna get going. But, uh, first, let's head back into the clubhouse for a few things. First off, head into our notebook here. And, uh... And just look over what new words he may have given us. Okay, first off, go pee. Ha, ha, ha. Um, looky. Basically lets you see stuff. Um, I'm not gonna dare explain what the other one says. Uh, this is no. This is fighting. Ouch. Um, scoochie, which allows us to climb. Uh, scritty, which is scratch. Uh, we know what Takyu is already. And last, yuppie. Okay, so those are all the words we now know, but, and this here is, uh, uh, who is this again? Uh-huh, he's not sleeping. Hello, Mr. Not Sleeping. So yeah, uh, this is actually Snoozer, if you're familiar with the anime, and basically what it is, he gives you hints throughout the game. If you are ever in a pinch, you can talk with him, and he will give you hints. Uh, you can hold the B button down to run. You can't do much right now, though, but let's go back here. And this guy you can talk to if you want to do some dances. Let's dig, though, where Boss was and get a rock. Um. Okay, um. I don't know what that will be useful for, but I don't know. I, I guess we can hold on to it. Alright, let's go ahead and go to the Acorn Shrine. Uh, uh, us? Um, okay. Well, that's good to know. Uh, oh, well. The acorn shrine? Uh, acorns? Uh, well, that's kind of obvious, wouldn't you say? Ah, uh, they're not in season. Oh, well. Oh. Um, looks like he's coming down with a cold, eh? Well, we could... Well, let's see what's in... Oh, yeah, I forgot. Uh, Taku only works, uh, up like this. Alright, well, let's just move around here. Uh, pick up these sunflower seeds. Get one. We now have eleven. Yeah, it's not gonna cut away each time. And we got a r another rock. Really, I wonder what all these rocks are gonna be for. I mean, they're just kinda lying around. Well, let's talk to this guy again. I don't know. We might get a word. Maybe two. Well, oh, a girl with a ribbon. And a, another cold. Huh. Uh, oh, hey, look. It's Bijou. Uh, she's blushing. Yeah, if any of you know the anime, you'll know that uh, Bijou uh, has a crush on Kamtaro. Well, let's use Dig Dig here, and see what's in here. Alright, here we have a boutique, in a sense. Which is basically where you can buy outfits. So, I'm just gonna let you uh, take a look. I'm just gonna see here. We can just buy stuff and hold on to it in our, uh, in, at our home. Uh, I'll just buy the chef's hat, because I kinda like it. I'm not really gonna do much, too much of this shopping. Maybe off camera. But, not really. It's kind of like one of the bonus stuff things you can do in-game, where you can, like, go around, buy clothing and everything, and what happens is you can put it on in your closet. You can't wear it in the overworld like here. No, sorry. You can only do it in front of the mirror. And it will be delivered to our house free of charge. Alright, well, that ought to do for now. So, this has been Let's Play Hamtaro, Hamtaro Unite. Um, this is All the Stars, signing off. Have a good day.